Welcome back to Jetline Marvel for another thrilling episode. In this video we will explore the new Apache helicopter. One of the American-built reliable, lethal combat helicopters is the Apache. The V-6 sub-variant of the AH-64E Apache Guardian serves as the foundation for a new modernized Apache attack helicopter concept that Boeing has unveiled. Hughes Helicopter began producing the Apache in 1975 and continued to do so until 1984. From that point on, McDonnell Douglas continued production of the Apache until 1997. Boeing then assumed responsibility for creating this aircraft and upholding the Apache helicopter's legacy. Although the frame of this helicopter hasn't changed in 41 years, its fighting qualities and ability to do the majority of heavy maneuvers remain unmatched. But as of right now, the majority of the newest helicopters come equipped with new avionics, armaments, and design ideas. As a result, Boeing has altered many aspects in the AH-64 version 6 helicopter to make it competitive with other helicopters on the market. The AH-64 Apache attack helicopter has no immediate replacement, so Boeing has started tossing around concepts for a new Apache that the Army may require to face emerging threats. The enhanced helicopter weapon extended pylon, which appears to be an M310 twin rail launcher fitted with two tubular launch containers for unidentified weapons on the new left outboard station, and some sort of pot on the right station, are the main changes on this helicopter. The Apaches are also all depicted loaded, two under each stub wing, with what look to be 16 Hellfire missiles on four rail launchers. The Apache could also include a Raytheon solid-state high-energy laser-directed energy weapon. The detection and engagement range of targets or other threats may be extended with enhanced radar, which may also improve the accuracy of the tracks. When used in conjunction with farther-reaching weapons, this would be a significant addition. It is frequently possible to track the helicopter in a sense of battle due to exhaust heat. The upswept engine exhausts are also shown in the design, as can be seen below. This is almost definitely done to further lessen the infrared signature of the aircraft. The improved turbine engine and a modular mission system backbone, the latter of which would enable the Army to plug in various sensors or payloads without needing to substantially revamp the system, will be two features that will be crucial to a future AH-64. According to a press release, future precision munitions, laser weaponry, or air-launched impacts are among the advanced mission technologies that could lighten a pilot's workload and lessen cognitive strain. Additionally, improved turbine engine capabilities for increased power, range, efficiency, and speed are being unlocked by new features being integrated into engine drivetrain modifications. That increases its lethality in terms of the battlefield's defensive actions. Further for better and more dependable operations in all climatic situations, new Apache helicopters with advanced sensors and sensor fusion will be added. To reduce the burden on operations while enhancing advanced sustainment through the use of an airframe with a better performance and lower life cycle cost, as well as more cheap remanufacturing and reduced procurement expenses. Comment below and let us know what you think of the new Apache helicopter. Please subscribe if this is your first time seeing our channel.